Sharan with Desi Plaza TV and uh, we are here with the very, very talented Arshad Khan. How do you feel about the f film festival? Um, thank you so much, first of all, for interviewing me. Uh, my name is Arshad Khan. I'm the director of the film Abu, which means father, which is a very personal film about my very difficult relationship with my very devout Pakistani Muslim father as a gay son. Um, and I think film festivals are extremely important platforms for independent voices and for diversity, you know, and a film festival like this that curates its program very carefully. I not only am able to present my film, but I am able to watch other people's films as well. And I'm able to learn from them and meet other filmmakers and other people that I might collaborate with in the future. So film festivals are a very, very important place to come to, um, to learn and, and to find surprising gems. Plaza TV and uh, we are here at uh, the DFW South Asia Film Festival and uh, how do you feel about the movie? Well, just really serious. I mean, doesn't leave you in a good mood, but it's it's like a heavy dose of reality, like a whole other world that we can't forget about. Right. So do, do you plan to uh, continue coming for the next three days for the festival? Oh, definitely. Since the beginning of the festival, I've been here every day, all through, you know, every year. All right, thank you very much. Really good quality, quality movies. So, are you excited about the film festival? Of course, very, very, very excited. And how do you feel about the movies that we just watched, Mehram and Don't Tell Anyone? Well, I've seen it already in uh, the Toronto. So, you know, uh, I really uh, like the film. So, uh, I'm very excited to see how they would react to my film, the Indian community over here abroad. I'm much more looking forward how they would react over here. So, can you talk a little bit about your movie, what it is about and what it is called? Uh, my film is about uh, an uh, auto rickshaw driver who has no idea about sex and he gets married to an 18 year old girl and what and he lives in a chawl with his parents so what happens the next 10 days after he gets married is all uh, the film all about it's a satire uh, take on mumbai and its chawls wow that sounds pretty interesting well good luck to you for the rest of the three days remaining and we'll catch up soon yes I was, I was just fascinated reading about your uh, biography and it looks pretty amazing. So, are you excited about your uh, movie? I'm very excited actually because it's the first time it's uh, traveling to America and uh, we just started our festival run and this is a great opportunity for us, so definitely. So, are you looking forward to attending all the four days of the festival? Yeah, yeah of course. Unfortunately, because of the flight, I couldn't make it to the film today. But then I'm definitely looking forward to the, all the other films playing. Awesome. And can you talk a little bit about your movie? Sure. So the film uh, Basmasur is about a father who's heavily in debt. So he decides to sell his donkey. But the son that he has really, uh, you know, wants to be with the donkey. So the film deals about the dilemma the father faces, whether to sell the donkey or to keep his child happy. Well, Basmasur it is to watch. And I'm definitely going to watch it. Thank you very much for your time, Nishu. Please do. Thank you so much.
Hi, this is Milan with Desi Plaza TV and we have with us Chatin. Chatin, what a beautiful event you have. Thank you so much. Thank you. It's been a lot of fun. It's been a lot of work and it's coming to fruition and everyone's here having a great time and we have a sold out opening night screening and you know we're just excited and I, I love that Dallas is embracing what we're doing uh, we're bringing amazing original South Asian films to Dallas uh, international premieres Texas premieres US premieres Dallas premieres and I think um, you know from what I'm seeing from people and what I'm hearing they're really enjoying what they're watching Absolutely, I, I'm one of those and I absolutely enjoyed the premiere and the Atuimo Day is all packed, lined up with beautiful, beautiful movies coming up. What do you have to talk, say about it? You know, I think that, you know, we're trying to appeal to kind of every demographic through our programming. So everything from children's programming to love programming to um, men's programming to father-son programming. I mean, we have all of these amazing themes that we work on and um, we've got great films to represent those themes. And I think you'll find something you love um, at our festival.